Mr. Weatherspoon and Marston's pub chains. Jamie's Italian restaurants, the leisure destinations of Butlins, Haven and Warner Hotels. We've established that some of the biggest catering outlets in Britain got meat from the firm at the centre of this food recall. Each has switched supplier and this breach of hygiene rules also affects schools and care homes. Now locked up, these Birmingham premises, run by the Russell Hume Company, were inspected by officials. What they found has led to a major withdrawal of meat from the market. In terms of how concerned we should all be about this, it's something that is worrying, that, that a major business is under an investigation of serious hygiene breaches. Tonight at the meat firm's HQ, a director of the company, Richard Kay, emerged unwilling to give an interview. Good evening, we Good evening. aren't doing an interview or anything, but we've done a pre-prepared statement. Thank okay. you for your time. Thank you. In it, the company says actions by food inspectors have come as a serious shock, that it has an unblemished record and that there has never been a suggestion of any product causing illness. But the Food Standards Agency says it's aware of instances of serious non-compliance with food hygiene regulations and is concerned about poor practices. They've taken action to ensure no meat can leave the company's sites. The 14 out. Aberdeen Angus. The Russell Hume name was prominent in this Weatherspoons video. The meat is now withdrawn, the pub chain claiming it and its customers have not been kept informed by the supplier. Now that's something we're very, very disappointed with. 36 hours we tried to find out on behalf of our 2 million customers a week and they've kept quiet. That's just not fair, it's not right. We've been told inspectors have concerns about six Russell Hume sites across the UK. Officials stress there is no indication anyone has become unwell, but senior figures within environmental health say this must be taken seriously. We know from the agency's statement that we're looking at breaches of food hygiene regulations, and because of there are breaches of the food hygiene regulations, those regulations are there for a purpose. They're there primarily to protect the health of the public the meat plant that no meat can now leave. The company says there is no reason to believe the food is unsafe. But once again, this industry is mired in a breach of the rules designed to keep customers safe. Chris Choi, News at 10.